Good morning, you rivers. Today is Tuesday, February 5th. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Today's lunch will be Mexicali Bowl, vegetarian nachos with cheese sauce, cold turkey ham and cheese sandwich, and chero pinto beans. This month's attribute is thinker, and today's quote is, all great thinkers are initially ridiculed and eventually revered. Robin S. Sharma. Teachers and students, tomorrow's third grade chorus members should, ha should report to the music room during morning arrival for instrumental and song review. Teachers and students, Friday movie afternoon for first and second grade is from 2.30 to 4.30 in the gym. Teachers and students, February 15th is the deadline to turn in your Black History essay and drawings, so make sure you are working on your essays and drawings for the contest. Teachers and students, today is the Chinese New Year, so we are going to end today's show with a short video telling us about the Chinese New Year. We hope you make it a great day. Bye! Chinese New Year is celebrated on a date between January 21st and February 20th. The origins of Chinese New Year are a mystery, but legend tells the tale of an ancient beast called Nian, whose name means year in Chinese. In ancient China, at the end of winter, the hungry monster would enter villages to eat crops and livestock. But the villagers discovered that Nian was frightened by loud noises, fire, and the color red. So every year on the last day of winter, the ancient Chinese people would decorate their houses with red paper cutouts and red hanging lanterns and set off fireworks to keep Neon away. He never returned, and the Chinese people have celebrated Chinese New Year with these good luck traditions for thousands of years since. To prepare for Chinese New Year, families traditionally clean every corner of their homes to symbolically sweep away any bad luck from the year before. Along with the red lanterns and red paper cutouts, they hang banners of poetry, called couplets, on either side of their doorways. These poems express wishes of hope and happiness for the new year. On Chinese New Year's Eve, many families gather together for a large reunion. They share a feast of traditional foods, play games, and exchange gifts. Kids receive special red envelopes containing money. Now that's good luck! Traditionally, at midnight, the family set off fireworks to celebrate the new year and to scare away Neon. Nowadays, many cities around the world have Chinese New Year celebrations for everyone to enjoy. There's Chinese food, music, performances, parades with traditional lion dances, and fireworks displays. What are your favorite New Year's traditions?